Namaste, Soul Tribe, Spiritual Healer. I'm back, guys. This message is for Aries. I love you guys, Aries. This is a quick love reading, Aries, for you guys. I just had to put this message out because Spirit told me there's someone that's really, really coming towards you quickly, Aries. And this is a love reading, a quick love reading for my beautiful Soul Tribe, my Rams, my beautiful Aries. Aries. You got somebody coming towards you, my love. Yes, this person, um, Aries, this person had left you out in the cold before, Aries. Yeah, you see that? The Five of Pentacles. This person had left you out in the cold. This person um, turned their back on you or they went towards somebody else, Aries. But um, yeah, this person wants to give you justice on the bottom of this deck. Justice came out. Can't make this up. And then this person wants to come forward with a beautiful offer of love, of commitment, or relationship. This person wants to reconcile with you, Aries, okay? Or this is a new person. This could be someone from your past, Aries, or a new person because um, Spirit told me that there's two people coming towards you, Aries. There's someone from your past that really wants to mend a broken heart with you guys that sees you as this beautiful queen or king of pentacles on your throne, very abundant and, and wise, starting new projects and businesses. This person sees you as their wish, Aries. Yes, they see you as this beautiful empress or goddess or god. They see you as very powerful and um, wise and intuitive. Yes, they see you as their wish, Aries. Yes, with the star card. This could be an Aquarius you're dealing with, Aries. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Okay, my loves. Or you could definitely be dealing with this water sign energy that keeps coming out in your love readings. Okay, Aries. So this Six of Cups is telling me this person is being nostalgic. So you definitely know this person. Um, You could have been with this person before or you just know knew each other. You went on a date or so. You, you guys liked each other but nothing came out of the situation. But this person is broken hearted, Aries, because they can no longer live without you. They can no longer stay away from you guys, my beautiful soul tribe. Okay? And also, Spirit said, they might have broke your heart in the past. And this is why they want to come give you justice and mend this broken heart and fix things with you guys. Yes, because this person, Aries, is is trying to start a new cycle with you guys with this world card here. Yeah, this person wants to start a new cycle with you guys, my loves. And um, this is going to be up to you, Aries, if you decide to take this person back. But this person is really, really um in their feelings about you, Aries. This person could have been with another in another relationship, but that relationship um, has recently... Um, came apart Aries because this person's feelings for you can no longer hide and this person just suddenly had a tower moment in their in their situation Aries this was spirits telling me right now and um hmm. yeah um they had a breakup a sudden breakup with the person they were with because they can't keep away from you Aries because this king of swords is 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 really in in his power and his truth also, Spirit said this person, this King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy has had an awakening to your connection, Aries, and they um they realize how, how much you mean to them. They realize that you are the love of their life, that they've been hiding these emotions, that they've been holding back. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Like this emperor, this emperor as well, um, it could be a fire sign, Aries Leo Sagittarius, but they see you as this emperor, Aries. This king of swords is viewing you as an emperor, male or female energy, okay, guys? Just because it says king of swords doesn't mean it can't be a female, okay? Embodying the king of swords energy. This is just an air energy, Aries. So that's why I say you could also be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Because this emperor, they see you as this emperor sitting on your throne, very abundant, very powerful, not playing no games, seeing the truth, knowing things, being wise, having wisdom, um, you guys can be, um, you guys can be healers and empaths or just like, um, very wise shamans, like type of energy I'm getting off you guys. You guys could be bosses, own your own businesses, but this person, um, you might think he's kind of, this person's kind of sneaky. You don't know if you trust this person, Aries, because in the past, this person could have been sneaky. Aries could have got away with something, could have been deceitful. Yes, but now this person is viewing you as this beautiful 
energy right here as a nine of pentacles energy they're viewing you as this beautiful queen or king very abundant working on your pentacles getting your abundance and this person is really really thinking about traveling towards you guys aries they're really thinking about coming towards you this person can be at a distance or it doesn't have to be that far but they're really trying to travel towards you my loves Aries, because you're receiving all these blessings with the Nine of Cups, this Nine of Cups energy, yes, you guys are receiving blessings at this time from Spirit and the angels, okay, they're very proud of you, my loves, you guys have been working hard on yourselves, you guys have been having the strength to heal, to move forward, to detach, you might have detached your energy from this person, Aries, but this person isn't done with you, my loves. This person is coming towards you at all costs. Um, this person will fight for you, Aries Spirit said. This person doesn't care what no one has to say. This person can no longer be away. Um, people could have been holding this person from coming forward to you, Aries, I heard. Because there was a lot of people that wasn't happy about the situation um, in the past with you guys. So there could have been people, jealous, envious people, friends or family members or whoever it was that interfered in your relationship. It could have been a third party situation, Aries, but this King of Swords energy right here, they can't hold back this anymore. They've been trying to tame themselves in their in their emotions, but they can't hold back anymore, Spirit said, because the full moon is making them come towards you so fast. Like this, look, like this Knight of Swords, they are charging forward and they're coming to speak their truth. Like I said before, remember, this Knight of Swords energy doesn't play, Aries, okay? They're coming in very hasty, and they got a bone to pick with you because you've been ignoring them. You you blocked this person, or you haven't been communicating or something. But, yeah, let me tell you, they're coming in as this Knight of Swords very, very quickly towards you, Aries, male or female, and they have something to say. And don't be surprised if they don't show up at your doorstep like this. Like, I want to talk right now. I don't care who's here. I don't care who you're with. I don't care, Aries. I'm going to fight for your love because I love you so much and I can't hold back any longer. And you guys have been blocking me. That's what they're saying. Wow. <laughs> Aries don't play, right? All right, Aries. So then, like this, this person's taking this leap of faith towards you, okay? With um, whatever they might have to offer. It might be big. It might be small. It might be little. It might be not. But whatever it is that they have to offer you, Aries, they're coming with it, okay? And they might even bring you flowers, Spirit said. But this person is going to take the leap of faith towards you because they can no longer hold back, okay? Because they see you taking all these leaps of faith in your life, making all these, making all this progress, having all this success in business, and doing work on yourselves, and you're just helping this person, guiding them towards you. This could be a soulmate energy or a twin flame energy, Aries, but they're coming, and it's your choice if you decide to hear them out. But yeah, they are taking this leap of faith. Because they want to work together with you as a team, Aries. They want to come together with you guys. Oh, some of these people, um, some of the um these people coming towards you, Aries, like for for different Aries involved in the situation, different Aries watching this video. Um, this person could have, could have seeked higher knowledge and wisdom. This person coming towards you could be an awakened person. He could be awakened. This person could be awakened to their gifts or their spiritual gifts. This person could have been seeking readings on you guys, Aries. This person could have been getting um spiritual wisdom or knowledge, gaining that knowledge because they see you as very spiritual and wise. And they're coming towards you as a brand new changed person, wanting to work with you as as a as a partnership, my loves, wanting to offer you commitment, Aries. Yeah, this is the next card, wanting to give you this beautiful relationship, this two of cups, this commitment. Okay, Aries. So yeah, this is beautiful. Oh, um, you guys could be dealing with a Leo heavy because you see that lion with the wings, like the Leo's flying towards you, Aries. Some of you guys are dealing with a Leo heavy, okay? Or your person has Leo in their chart heavy, okay? Because this person might be younger than you, but this person sees you as beautiful. This person sees you as handsome. This person can't get their, can't, can't get you out of their mind. This person is thinking about you 24-7, Spirit said. Yes. And they really, really want to come and fix that broken heart. They really, really want to come and work together with you, Aries. They see you as their beautiful wish, my loves. Yes, this is a beautiful partnership coming together. Yes, and this is your beautiful love reading, your energy for this week, for today, actually, my loves. you Aries, you guys know I love you so much, okay? You guys know I'm going to always upload every time for you guys because you guys always support me so much, and I love your beautiful comments. I love all you guys. I send you all my best wishes, Aries. 
I send you all my love and my healing. And just know you guys have money. You guys have fortune coming in your lives. You already know this because I tell you guys this enough. You guys are being blessed with tenfold abundance for all everything that was taken from you guys, for your inheritances, for your trust funds, for your assets, for your lawsuits, for your settlements, for your pain, for your hurt. And also God is blessing you with this beautiful love coming towards you, wanting to reconcile, wanting to bring you the justice that you deserve. Yes. Okay, so Aries, keep your head up, keep being strong, keep be being beautiful and handsome, keep shining like that diamond, my loves. Yes, this is your beautiful love reading from Spiritual Healer. I love you guys. Till the next time, Aries. Namaste.